Town without the Colonel. Can't hardly imagine it. Oh, please, brother. He a common thug. Not even that. Not no more. Warm food's warm Tone food. Tone it down. Ah, at last. I lacked the time to brew tea. My apologies. Face to face again, what's changed? Everything, and that's what we'll discuss. Kurt Hansen, a man of many hats. A criminal, dog of war. To mine eye, an entrepreneur. And business suffocates in a vacuum. Vultures circle the Colonel's corpse already. The enterprise he built must choose a new leader. We will make certain they choose correctly. The shard, please insert it. Let me guess, got a successor all lined up, don't you? Lieutenant Colonel Bennett, one of Hansen's most loyal, commands respect, is capable of rallying a strong base. The logical choice, this gentleman soldier. Alas, he has competition. A man named Yago. He's starting from a lower rung, but has high aspirations. He's already begun seeking outside support from the Voodoo Boys. You will meet with Yago. You will convince him to back down. Yago not up to snuff? Why? He's an accountant. No soldier. Kept Hansen's books for him. V. You don't win hearts by counting numbers. Okay, I'll handle that. No, you won't. But Aguilar will. Uh, you lost me. Hansen remained on top because he had the contacts to stay afloat. Most important among them was a Cuban cartel. Enter Aguilar. A merc assassin from Havana. A living legend. Every time someone in Havana lights a cigar, Aguilar extinguishes a life somewhere around the globe. I'm lucky to have his behavioral imprint on hand. You're lucky to have experience with the tech already. Let me summarize. Need me to assume Aguilar's identity... Have a chat with Yago. Talk him out of any silly ideas he might have. 
child's play. Okay, all's crystal. I prepared a shard with helpful intelligence, also a weapon, the same Aguilar uses. Help yourself to both. V. Interesting piece of iron. Custom made. A unique and highly persuasive tool. Mm hmm. Time to kick the tires, V. Suit up and take the imprint for a whirl. the difference. My time's precious, hands. If this don't work, you'll need to find ten new digits or aim for a rebrand. Hmm. Better than expected, V. Or rather, Aguilar. You'll make a strong impression on Yago, too. A trusted source tells me he's to meet soon with a delegation of the Dogtown Voodoos. I'll forward the coordinates. Whoa. I care not at all for how you handle the Gangoons. <laughs> As you will. I have only one request. Yago withdraws his candidacy. Once you've shown him reason, call me. And remember, my district's future is riding on this. Dogtown's future and yours. Don't fuck me over, Hans. <laughs> Rehearsing, are you? Close. Just a bit lacking. Good luck. Time to go Cuban.
côté isolé. Y'a go ça, si on fit chat, we don't. Allez, ça c'est pas territoire. I have good news. We will talk. I would not shed your blood. A very good deal. Moi fout avec you. Ma pute fini. for the man out in the open ah what a face off to you agala you saucy senior there they are gonk's got no clue what's coming think i'm gonna shed a tear Something ain't right, boss. And you are her. I answered with my own question. Do you know what happens when someone in Havana lights a cigar? Somewhere in the world, Aguilar takes a life. So they say. Do you know what else they say? That you have angered the wrong people. We know of your plan to oust Bennett. We know of your new allies. The Voodoo Boys? <laughs> Poor choice. My superiors follow Christ, Iago. I... I never intended any disrespect. What happens now? Would you follow in your co-conspirator's footsteps? No, of course not. Aguilar, please. It's not what you think. May I explain, at least? Very well, but be quick. Bennett is an Arasaka pawn. They courted him until he cracked. Then they waited. They needed the Colonel to die. I don't know what they promised him. But I do know what they want. Control of Dogtown. You have proof of Bennett's deception, I trust. Know where to find it. He goes to the city center often, Republic Way. The building's a front, occupied by a dummy corp owned by Arasaka. As to Bennett's biz there, ask him, press him. You'll see him, right? Please pass my gratitude along to your superiors. Let's go. Plot thickens. Once they're gone, uncloak for your face melts like Scott Chaco. Just getting started, Johnny. Guess you ought to keep hands in the loop. Or... We could see what his favorite son's cooking up with fucking Arasaka. After all, Dogtown's future hangs in the balance. Well played, Aguilar. I five, mi hermano cubano. As indeed. Also, Voodoo Boys are out of the equation. Splendid. Have you anything else to add? 
Actually, yeah. Yago claims Ben and Narasaka are fucking. A man with his balls in a vice makes many interesting sounds. A fixer, however, separates fact from the spewings of a panicked soul. My concern now, not yours. Still, I thank you for telling me. What now? Time to be a tribute to the fallen. Aguilar will attend Hansen's funeral service and ensure a smooth transfer of power. Uh -huh. Sounds like you expect trouble. Such events can trigger geysers of raw emotion. No two people grieve alike, and rarely rationally. Ceremony and wake both at the Black Sapphire. Aguilar should enter without a hitch. Got it. Leroy more. Vive Leroy. Good luck, V. time, Aguilar had a word with Bennett. Ain't our guy that. Probably his hustle. Take him out now, just in case. Save yourself the headache later. <laughs> Tell you what Aguilar do. Dump the body, stat. Then wait for Bennett in the Rhine. Get the jump on him. same page. They agreed to back me. Two unmarked tactical units. 
in Dogtown. Gordon, let's roll. But what a grind. Japanese suits have their neckties tied so fucking tight. Wait, who? Oh, fuck. Aguilar! So you know now how the Japanese tie their neckties. Do you know the Colombian way? The Colombians cut open your neck. Pull your tongue out through the hole. It sounds complicated, but I've had plenty of practice. Aguilar, please, listen to me. I know what this must look like. This fuckhead Yago. You're a convict. Hmm. He's trying to cut me out. Arasaka's promised to have my back. All they want in exchange is access to our smuggling routes. No, what they seek is control of your smuggling routes. Only a fool would think otherwise. I'm out to secure the future. For my organization. For your bosses. And if Iago was not the problem, perhaps I've spoken to him already. Perhaps he has realized the error of his ways. A slippery leech, that one. I know a lie when I hear one. I know Iago did not lie. He will support you, as will I. <laughs> well, now that's a different story. One Cuban in my corner is worth more than ten Arasaka boardrooms. Agreed. We have a deal. I'll forget about the Japanese. One last question. Where the fuck is my driver? You should forget about him, too. Dream work, Aguilar. Time for a breather, though. The final act. Hansen's wake. Enter Aguilar. Shit, V. Got me on the edge of my seat. Get this show on the road. Oh shit. 
Time to go. Don't ask why. So, ready? Cuban cartel? Here? Aguilar, in honor for all of us. Take me to Bennett. He came with extra security. Got a bad feeling. Aguilar, what a surprise. I understand you've met. Havana sends its condolences. The news of Colonel Hansen's death shook us all. I'm sure the Colonel would appreciate your goodwill. You're dismissed. I met earlier with a lieutenant colonel. We had a lovely conversation talking of this and that. In the end, we both agreed Dogtown needs a strong leader. That leader will be Bennett. The people here heed his words, as will you, Iago. Oh, until when? Until you leave town and he's free to stab me in the back? I want names, contacts, Connections, your informants in the NCPD, everyone on your payroll. Ridiculous. You will prove your loyalty to me. Big Baby Bennett wants a new toy. Something to silence his tantrums. <laughs> Too bad. The turns cannot change, Bennett. Then there's no deal! Wait, 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 let's talk! We've talked enough. Control yourself, Bennett. I am in control. No one moves a goddamn inch, or you join Yago. Yes, sir. Looks like I'm all you got left. Give Havana my regard. The die is cast, Colonel. Leave the scumbag's corpse there for now. It can serve as a warning.
Dog eat dog world, I guess. What's that make dog town? A warning to you, Silverhand. One you will heed. Take a bow, V. Had our fun, but it's time we sent Aguilar off with a heartfelt... Adios, Aguilar. Adios. It's been real. an apex predator can make a fine you handsome and Yago will never challenge again shame all his contacts went to the grave with him regrettable as oversights go V things got a little out of hand did what I could though did you now when I hire a pro I expect professionalism for anything less, I pay less. I trust that's clear. That'll be all for now. I'll be in touch.
V, it's been quite some time. What can I do for you? I don't know. It's, uh, it's for a friend. Just helping a friend. Listen, Yoko. And still you had swing by? It's about a gig. Oh, so it is you he meant. This day just got more interesting. First, I'll need confirmation our mutual acquaintance, in fact, sent you. Then we can talk. Connect here. I'll verify through biometric scan. This necessary? Really? We know each other. Are you certain? This is Night City, V. No one can say they truly know another. So no more whining. This has to happen anyway for the data decryption. Okay, have at it. Decryption will take a moment. Apologies. But it's necessary for a job of this caliber. Well, well, V? I didn't expect us to work together again. How is your running? Polishing your skills? Not one to brag, but... Pretty damn good if I say so myself. Yet not good enough for you to dig into certain records for a certain person, huh? Ouch. <laughs> Below the belt, Yoko. Right? With the formalities done, let's begin. All you need is here. Just so you know, gathering it wasn't easy. The Max Tac Data Fortress is a labyrinth. And a panopticon combined. Every node you pass attracts a thousand unwanted stares. But you managed. <laughs> You're my hero, Yoko. Wait. Our cooperation need not end here, if you catch my meaning. That is, if you plan to do what I think with this data. Interested? Maybe. Now, strict hypothetical. What you think I aim to do? Let's suppose you positioned yourself where a certain convoy was to pass. Mm-hmm. And? And let's suppose you are either prepared or insane enough to eliminate the guards of the convoy. Hot or cold? Let me guess. You're interested in the, uh, human cargo? No, but I assume you are. Our mutual friend would offer additional thanks for the windfall that would result from this. If you would be so kind and send us the coordinates of the location where you deal with your problem. You after max stack gear, is that it? Get there before anyone else does? Mm, you would only need to send the coordinates. Give it a shot, but no promises. I need the coordinates, nothing more. In return, I guarantee a generous reward. Good luck. I know that did is causing us for Max Tap and Max Murder. They'll have to get in line. Touche. Alrighty. Let's get Reed's super spot pieces. See where it leads.
Jumping Max Tack now, are we? Stepping up your game. Busting into Arasaka Tower, it ain't. But it's up there. Somewhere. Trying to knock me off the arch terrorist pedestal? The famed JS got a hot take on all this? On going toe to toe with Max Tack? Hell yeah. Good fucking luck. Cause you're gonna fucking need it. Mint Reed and Songbird. Huh, what's there to say? Chick bought a one-way ticket to cyber hell, floored the chew and cut the brakes. And she's dragging us along. Can say that again. No, uh that was not part of our deal, Rick. This your partner? Fuck me. Didn't know you'd signed on to some suicide pact. Need to do a better job vetting your partners, Reed. Cause it seems you're now running with a murdering piece of human trash. Oh, please. Gonna fucking pretend you're innocent? Enough of that. Well, then, I just hope the FIA will send us new contact deets once you're busy pushing up daisies. But if you do survive this cat orgy of an op, remember, you and me are square now. <laughs> Modern day patriotism for you. About time we went over the plan. Sixth Street, here, at your beck and call. The NUSA's fifth column in NC. We toss some equipment, little cash here and there, nothing unusual. In return for doing your dirty work, I'm guessing. You are guessing, but we got biz to discuss, don't we? Ready to plan, strategize? Got everything we need? Got everything we can count on having. I flicked through your intel. Convoy routes, vehicle array, Weaponry they're likely to have. It's not gonna be easy. The reason they're called psycho squads twofold. They're almost cyber psychos themselves. The best chance we have of stopping them is here. Traffic minimal, vantage points optimal. They'll come down this road. Once in range, we hit them hard. Bring them to a stop. We then neutralize all max tac operatives, grab Songbird, run it to an exfil point just across the SoCal border. Our friend here knows the specifics. He'll fill you with. I got one last thing I need to take care of. All right, let's hear what you've cooked up. Hmm. Here's a lowdown. Convoy will roll in from the northwest. Likely run right into the booby trap cars will set up. This could decommission a few vehicles, force the rest to switch lanes. We'll cut off any chance of retreat. Set off some planted charges, stop them dead in their tracks. Second read pops a behemoth driver, you'll dive in. Your chum read also requested some badass toys. Offensive turrets, mines, smoke grenades, ladder, not an issue. But the mines and turrets, want to weigh in, sift to the deets, or leave prep to me. It's your call. Listen, your gear, you know best. Leaving the prep to you. Damn, quite the demonstration of trust. I'm flattered. No, moved. <laughs> okay, we'll do our thing. Preem, appreciate the help. Gonna have a word with Reed. Hmm. Gonna set up then, and make tracks. As for you two, well, good fucking luck.
Ready on my end. You? Almost. This is our jammer. I just need to calibrate it so the signal isn't too strong. Otherwise, so me could... I just hope we're not too late. Too late for what? Reed? Let's focus on the task at hand. Damn it, what do I gotta do to get you to talk to me? We are talking. <laughs> yeah, see that. Spill it, come on. You have any questions about Maxtech? Now's the time. Fuck me. Dodging always your go-to when the talk gets tough. You want to know the truth? Fine. Today, or seven years ago, don't know what exact point I fucked up. The end result's that now we're here while she, she could die. I just pray that she's, she's the one we're saving. The soul me I knew, and not some... Fucking scared, V. Scared my grip on everything is slipping. There. Happy? If anyone's lost control in this sitch, it's her, not you. But it's still so me. She's there to save, truly. And I believe we will. It's an either or situation, V. Either we got it right, could very well be that. Or she's been playing us for fools from the start. I just gotta jam max tax frequencies. Get ready. That thing jamming his pangs of conscience, too? Ought to get myself one. What do you want about now? Chick's a half brain dead, half AI controlled zombie, yet still the gonk's convinced his old partner's trapped inside. That only he can save her. Maybe he's scared this might all be his fault. New guys like him in the army. Gonks who thought they were born to hold people's lives in their hands. Shit never ended well. Always with a lose-lose. Just talk to her. Huh? Body language. I could tell you enabled the relic. So was it her? Did you grab hold of Song? Uh, no, just a side effect of the relic. You choose a Langley, I have their work cut out for him. Right, understood. All right, jam is calibrated. Do you know what to do? Take my position, await the convoy. Going hot when I see the charges pop. We grab Song and head for the X4 point on the border. Clean quick, no slip ups, no trip ups. And one eye on song the whole time. Got it? Okay. Moving to my position. Good luck, Reed. We won't need luck. <laughs>